Hello everyone. In this high yielding shorts, I'm going to tell you about giant cell tumor, which is also known as osteoclastoma. It's a benign tumor, but locally aggressive tumor. Most common site will be the femur, distal part of the femur involving epiphysis. Females are commonly affected and the age group will be 20 to 50 years. On examination of the gross specimen, you will find red brown mass. You can notice this is the red brown mass and they are having cystic degeneration. You can see tiny cysts are also visible right with yellow yellow borders are present right on x-ray examination of the distal part of the femur now you can see there is a expensile lytic lesion and that is the reason for the soap bubble appearance so these are expensile lytic lesion giving soap bubble appearance on cytogenetic analysis of these tumor tumor cells will be having mutation in histone 3.3 variants of a gene known as h3 f3 a gene which is required for chromatin packaging in this patient if you are going to see the microscopic examination they will have two components tumor cell will be uh, one is tumor cell and second cell second is the non tumor cell tumor cell will be having uniform mononuclear oval cell as you can see the main thing is the uniform mononuclear cell can you see these are all uniform mononuclear cell only one nuclei so that is the tumor cell and because of this tumor cell they are going to activate the osteoclast type of giant cell so non tumor cells are the multinucleated osteoclastic type of giant cell so please remember majority of the tumor cells are the uniform mononuclear right multinucleated osteoclastic cells are non-tumor cells. Keep learning, enjoy learning and best wishes for your exams.